Sweden has officially closed its investigation into the 2022 explosions that severely damaged Russia's Nord Stream pipelines. Prosecutors in Stockholm declared on Wednesday the conclusion of their probe into the suspended attack in September 2022, nearly seven months following Russia's invasion of Ukraine. The mysterious explosions on Nord Stream's one and two pipelines occurred amidst Europe's struggle to reduce its dependence on the significant volumes of Russian gas imports they provided to Germany. Amid accusations exchanged between the Kremlin, Ukraine and Western powers, Swedish authorities previously pointing fingers at an unidentified state actor have now halted the investigation, citing its jurisdictional limits. According to public prosecutor Mats Langwist, the primary objective was to determine if Swedish citizens were involved in the incident or if Swedish territory facilitated the attack. With neither circumstance applicable, the conclusion was reached that Swedish jurisdiction did not apply. Meanwhile, a separate investigation by German prosecutors remains ongoing. The undersea explosions ruptured the Nord Stream 1 pipeline on September 27, severing Russia's primary natural gas supply route to Germany. Simultaneously, the Nord Stream 2 pipeline, which never became operational due to Germany suspending its certification process, also suffered damage. Aside from the geopolitical ramifications, the leaks caused an environmental catastrophe, impacting local wildlife and resulting in substantial methane emissions into the Baltic Sea, potentially marking the largest human-caused methane release. The explosions occurred approximately 80 metres under the water's surface in the Baltic Sea's economic zones of Sweden and Denmark, with seismic data indicating the blasts preceding the leaks detection. Despite more than 16 months passing since the sabotage, no definitive explanation has been universally accepted. Various reports have implicated Russia, the US and Ukraine in the attacks, while Russian authorities have accused the US of orchestrating the explosions, the US denies involvement. Swedish prosecutors have previously suggested a state actor as a likely perpetrator but acknowledge the uncertainty surrounding the identity of the assailant. The Kremlin has labelled Sweden's decision to close the investigation as remarkable, while reiterating its stance that the US may be responsible. Danish police, on the other hand, have affirmed that their investigation continues with updates expected shortly. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.